This is hydrogen tap. What you're looking at is the Focus One, the system that I've been working towards for the whole year. The tube that you're looking at there is 15 inches high. Sixteen inches from the bottom to the very top of the bolt, the electrode. Got the wing nuts off and you can see how everything is connected here. The cell comes out and you can see the water sensor unit down here. Looking at the top through the bottom angle or from the cell side you can see the stainless steel bolts that go through and the bottom of the water out or hydrogen out systems. You can see how easy that is put together. These bolts slip right out. Going down to the cell itself, the plates are put together with these bolts that are made of nylon and stainless steel screws. The plates are convertible. They will enable you to remove them and change them. It's a good view of the spacing or the spacers in there. The spaces in this cell that I'm showing you is one eighth inch apart. Each spacer is actually two spacers, so you can take that from one eighth to one sixteenth inch. Configuration is up to you. Also, it comes with stainless steel washers that enable you to replace the spacers with washers between the neutral plates. More views of the top. You can see two master plates come with the electrode that sticks directly up and connects to the stainless steel bolts. What we're going to do now is take off the tube and show you the fitting for it. You've got a rubber grommet that fits on the top and is usually glued to one either the top or the bottom. This is the frame. You can see the water output port. Goes through into the bottom of the tube. The tube is glued to the bottom when you get it, not to the top. And you can see the spacers in between. Everything is made for quick access. What I've done for you here is take away the tube and show you the suspension of the cell as it sits inside. If you look, you can see the space between the cell in the bottom plate.
That's to ensure there's proper circulation around the cell. Another view of the top. And you can see the water sensor level. The plates are 3 by 8 inches. That's not including the extenders, the electrodes that go up. The entire system, or the entire kit, comes in two configurations. One, as you see it here. The second is with the tube wire and gauges. There is actually one other configuration that you can get, and that is just the cell itself, which is just the plates. That's without the two. As always, if you want to email me at johnarons at hydrogentap.com, I'm always glad to get your email. If you want to place orders, you can go to hydrogentap.com.